everyone, my name is Chloe, welcome to my channel. So today's video is going to be a nasty gal haul. Um, I haven't done one of these on my channel before, I've rarely shopped from there to be honest, but I've been seeing loads of hauls on YouTube um, from there and I was like, why not? Uh, one day I was just scrolling through, was adding stuff to my basket, next thing I knew I've got a big order and I've spent nearly £200. So... Today's video is going to be a try on haul, I'm going to try on all the pieces and talk to you about them. Um, yeah, I'm really excited to do this one. I did say to myself that in June I would buy no clothes and I would challenge myself to buy no clothes and I think I ordered all this stuff on the 3rd of June so that went really well <laughs> but oh wow, life's too short right? So let's just try on the clothes. I thought the first item I'd put on are these jeans. Um, I'm absolutely obsessed with these jeans. I, for some reason, I thought they weren't going to fit me and they were going to come up really small because I got them in a size 8, um, but they honestly fit me like a glove. Like, not too tight, not too roomy, like I don't need a belt, but I absolutely love them. I love the colour, I love the fit of them. Um, but yeah, I really, really love these jeans. They fit so nicely. Um, and I'm really loving this kind of like jean at the moment where it's like kind of a straight leg and it's got the split in it I just think it's really flattering and it makes my legs look longer and I need that because I'm only six foot three um six foot three low I wish five foot three <laughs> six foot three Jesus um so yeah I'm really obsessed with these I think these will just look really nice just casually as well with like sandals or trainers although it might be a little bit too long for me to do that but if you were a bit taller then you could totally get away with it or um obviously on me i just wear them with heels on <laughs> nights out or like brunches and things like that so yeah i'm obsessed with these so i've just slightly adjusted the camera angle so that you can see more of the bottoms than the top half um so this is a satin skirt um it's like a nice tealy colour. They had this in a lilac, pink, black, I think. So I'm definitely going to go back and order some more because I'm absolutely obsessed with this skirt. And so it does come up a little bit long, but you can always just like fold the band over and kind of like roll it up to your desired length. So I'd probably wear mine a bit more shorter, just a bit un like under the knee rather than like mid calf. Um, and I feel like even if you roll it over, like it doesn't look like you have, like it doesn't look like there's loads of fabric there or anything. Um, so yeah, I love that. I just think this fits like a glove. Again, the sizing on this is great. I honestly was sceptical that it would fit, but it has got an elastic waist. So I've got this in a size 8, which is perfect for me. Um, but yeah, the elastic waist is great. And I love the colour, the quality of it feels nice, considering it's quite like cheap. It doesn't feel like really thin. It's really nice. And I love the colour, I just think it is so nice. And you can kind of pair these skirts with anything. They go with like trainers and a t-shirt. They go with heels and a bodysuit. They go with just sandals and like a little crop top. Doc Martens, um, and like in the winter you can dress them up and <laughs> you can style them with like jumpers. They're so versatile and I feel like, I know that they're a skirt but sometimes if you wear them with boots and stuff then you're pretty much covered anyway. So they last you all throughout the summer through to winter which I really love that in clothes. I like clothes that you can kind of change up and have them for all seasons. Um, so yeah, really impressed with the quality of these skirts. Okay, so next up I have this black dress on. So this dress is actually like a crinkled material. Let me come in closer and hope that you can kind of see what I mean. Um, and yeah, it's got this little, nice little neckline and then that's the back. Um, this is kind of like a midi dress and it's got little slits up the side of the leg, which is so flattering. Um, I really love this. I just thought it's such a simple dress and it's one that I can wear to work and it not be too short um, and you can kind of wear it with sandals or again it's one of those pieces that is quite transitional and I could wear this in the winter with Doc Martin boots and like a chunky like um, cardigan or even like you could put a t-shirt under it or over it it's quite a versatile piece but also on its own it's like amazing because it's just a black dress which everyone needs but it's just a really flat rim black dress it's not too like bodycon and tight but it's also not loose so it's quite flattering like around here um 
and yeah you can just dress this up with like jewelry and if you want to wear heels with it then you could and um, this is also quite a good dress i'd say for like work if you work in like an office environment i feel like you could definitely get away with something like this um obviously it depends how kind of lenient your office wear is but um yeah i don't know i really like this dress i think it's a staple dress that will just last for ages because it's just simple but also the crinkle material makes it look a bit different and the neckline and yeah i really really like it there's not that much i can say but it is a really nice dress um, to have in my wardrobe. So next I have this little cold on. Um, so yeah, this comes together as a set, but I love the fact that with a cold you can wear the top separately, like this would look really nice with jeans. Um, and then the skirt also you could wear separately with a little bodysuit or top or whatever. Um, but I come into it closer. So it's this lovely like cream color um, with like a chocolatey brown, like I don't even know what you'd call this, like lettuce lettuce edging or is it like cabbage edging i can't remember what it's called um the sleeves are super long like this is the sleeves pulled down and as i've just got short arms but it doesn't really bother me i quite like the fact that it's like long obviously you can also like bunch it up this feels really thick material so this would like really keep you warm on a colder day but equally like it's not so thick that it's like a jumper if that makes sense um love that the skirt is not too short as well absolutely hate it when skirts are like too short because i just like where am i gonna wear that <laughs> um but yeah I'm, I, I just love this top so it's pretty much the same all the way around although actually no the back's plain i didn't realize um but i'm loving like the little edging around the neck as well i just think it it's just all really nice i love it and um, it's just a little casual cord that you could chuck on with some trainers or if you had a little pair of like brown heels, I think that would look really cute, like little brown mules you could like wear <laughs> with it. Um, I know that Jordan Lipscomb got this in her Nasty Girl haul, and I saw it on her and I was like, I love it. It doesn't look as good on me as it does on her, but I mean, it's Jordan Lipscomb, do you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> obviously it's not going to look as good on me, but... I do really like it. I feel like I'll probably wear the top more than the skirt, but it did come as a set, so I couldn't not get the skirt, if that makes sense. Um, but I do think that it's also cute as a little set. So yeah, I'm really loving this one so far. So everything so far is, you know, so far so good. So let's put on another piece that I'm not so sure about, and you guys will have to let me know in the comments what you think. Okay, so you have to excuse the fact that I've not got a bra on, and I would definitely wear a bra with this dress. But it's just this little orangey terracotta, I suppose. Orangey red, I don't know, um, dress. Now, I absolutely love it. Like, I love the sleeves. I think that's really nice. I really like the colour. The only thing that I'm not that keen on is, like, the material. It's quite, like, crinkly, so it just looks like it's always a little bit, like, like it needs an iron. Um, and also, so obviously it's off the shoulder like this, which is great, but it's so short. And if I raise my arms up, like this kind of happens and then it's like really short that the vagina is like out <laughs> and nobody wants to see that um yeah and I, I really do like it but I remember I think this was about 21 pound and I think for 21 pound for me it's not going to get the wear out of like I'm not going to get the wear out of it that would like then like you know what I mean like I'm not going to get the wear out of it to justify paying 21 pound I know that's not a lot of money but still it kind of is um and i do i do really like it so i am in two minds about it my mum doesn't like it when i tried it on the other day she was like i don't like that i was like okay um so you guys have to let me know is it a little bit something or nothing because i was just thinking this would look cute with just some sandals just to like throw on but like i said it is a bit annoying because the top goes up like that then it goes really short or even if i have it down like how it's meant to sit if i raise my arms up like that happens and it's short so i feel like it's all it's just one of those like dresses that you'd have it on and you'd constantly be like adjusting it and like making sure that your bum and your vagina's not flying out to everyone so i feel like i might send this one back but let me know in the comments what you guys think of it and if you think i should keep it or not <laughs> guys i am dying at this dress and not in a good way <laughs> um hi <laughs> so right let's just not judge me for a moment for ordering this because i 
in the photo I feel like it didn't look this extra um I like the colour I like the crinkledness it's the sleeves if the sleeves were not so freaking awful I don't even know how to explain like I feel like a clown I actually feel like a clown so yeah if the sleeves were not so awful and they were just kind of like ruffled but not so big and extra then I probably could vibe this but it's awful so it's 100% going back but do you know what I can see on the right person in the right setting how this could work like cute heels like very like extra vibes but for me absolutely not uh, look, I'm one for extra, I love a bit of extra, you know, I love something different, but this is just ridiculous, the sleeves, it's the bottom bit, like I can't, because basically it's got this like elastic band, which is great, but then there's like no, uh, look, let's just get this off and let's just move on and pretend that this didn't happen. <laughs> okay, I feel like I've maybe redeemed myself with this one. Um, I'm absolutely flipping obsessed. I love it. Um, it's a little bit short, I won't lie, but I love it. So let me come in a bit closer. So it's just this like satiny dress and I love the fact that one strap is like a little strap and one's a thicker strap. I just think that that looks really cool. Um, I like that it kind of goes in here, it goes straight down and then the skirt's got like a little slit in it. Um, the material is not one for the bloated belly so ignore that um, because the problem with like satin is it does show every lump bump and just you know every sin but I don't care because I love this dress and I think that the colour is so nice like a plummy purple colour they did also have it in a black I want to say um, which I liked as well but I, this colour was you know it just drew me to this one um or I was just drawn to this one should I say but yeah I absolutely love it it's got a zip up the back um it is a bit short I won't lie it is short um but I think like you know if you're just sat down like having drinks I don't really think it matters and I like the fact that it's not too booby like I mean I don't really care about getting like getting my boobs out <laughs> No, I really like my cleavage or whatever. Like, that doesn't bother me, but I do like the fact that this one is just quite like modest. Is that the word? Modest? And like reserved? I don't know. But yeah, I really, really love this one. I think it's really nice and flattering. And it would look cute with just some little sandals, like on holiday. Or obviously dress it up for a night out with like some little heels. Um, but yeah, I, I'm obsessed with the colour. And I love it. So there's no way that I can show you this. Um, it is a jumpsuit, so there will be a little video here of me in it full length. But yeah, so this is a jumpsuit, like I said, um, and this was six pound. I think it was like six pound sixty. But for a whole outfit, how good is that? They had it in a baby blue colour, which I was going to get, and I think a, like a champagne colour. But I went for the orange because orange is just a bit of me. But I'm really not sure on this one. Again, I need your guys' opinion. So let me just talk you through it. So obviously we've got this bit at the top, which is just like a little bit of fabric which bags over, which I just think is quite cute. Um, it has got shoulder pads in it. Um, I don't know if you can see here, but you can cut them out. And if I were to keep this, then I would cut it out. I know that it is to give you that like shape, but I just think it looks a bit silly on me. So I would cut them out but obviously keep them whatever um this is the back which I absolutely love I love that there's like a little like V back I think that's really flattering and then yeah it just goes down into a trouser but it is really long on me so I would have to take it up um but that's fine so I'd have to take it up cut the shoulder pads out <sighs> I do, these, I do like it. Let me just look in the mirror. I do really like it. And I do think for £6.60, it actually feels, like, the quality feels good. Like, it, it's nothing spectacular, but it's, you wouldn't think it was, like, £6. Do you know what I mean? It, it's, like, quite a good quality. It's not, like, see-through. 
um, and I do love the colour and I think that for a whole jumpsuit it's, it's really good but I don't know if it's worth me keeping it to cut the shoulder pads out and to take the bottoms up like where will I wear this where would I wear? maybe I'd wear it on holiday or like out for a drink but then would I I suppose I would maybe I should just keep it because I was going to send this one back but it, it was only £6.60 and I just think like you know do you know what I mean? I don't know. Can you guys let me know what you think of this as well and where I would wear it? Because I I think on holiday it would look cute with just some like sandals. Um, or just not even on holiday, like wherever. Um, or like you could wear it for drinks, I suppose, with like a little heel. The more uh, I'm like talking myself into it more. Um, I don't know. <laughs> just let me know what you guys think. Thanks. Okay, so now um, I've got these shorts to show you, which I absolutely love. They're like a denim short and they're zebra print. Um, they're high-waisted and they fit like a glove. I think I got everything in an A. I will write it on the screen with the price as well. Um, but yeah, I'm pretty sure I got everything in an A. And it, honestly, they fit so nicely. Um, I just think they're like really cool. I would pair them with basically like what I've got on, like a bright coloured top some sandals or some trainers um i really really like these i think they're just cool comfy and yeah i don't know i like anything with a bit of print um and i don't actually have any denim shorts that are like patterned like this um i think they're a good length they don't like they're not really like a bummy or anything like that so yeah they're just a really good length and i like the fact that they're black and white and you can just pair a nice bright top with them okay and the last item i'm going to show you today i'm not actually going to try on because they don't fit me so they're these trousers and they're kind of like this like it's not a cow print it's just some sort of like marbly print um, and they're a flare they're like cream and black so they're not white they're cream and they're just really stretchy but basically these trousers are made for someone who is like six foot tall really skinny because for me i put them on and the high waistedness like didn't go up high waisted enough for my liking and then around my thighs because it like stretched the material because this, this bit is quite thin obviously like it does that thing where it stretches the pattern and i don't like that and then obviously it went down into the flare but they're really long so we're like bagged up at the bottom <laughs> basically they just looked awful um, and yeah, I really don't like them. So that's that really. <laughs> um, I like them obviously on the website and I thought they could look quite cool with like Doc Martens, but to be honest, the fact that they're not white as well, the fact that they're cream and black, just wasn't really a bit of me because they just look like they've been washed and worn a few too many times. Um, but I think I like the style and I know that they've got these in like different patterns and stuff. But yeah, if you're short, then yeah, they're probably not the ones for you. But yeah, that was that. <laughs> So that is everything that I did pick up from Nasty Gal. So overall, I think it's been a pretty successful haul. There's like three things I'm gonna take back. Um, so yeah, I'm really loving the new pieces that I've got. Thing is with Nasty Gal, I think a lot of the stuff is quite different. It's different to what, you're fi what you'd find in like H&M or, I don't know, um, Zara. Like it is quite different and I like that. So yeah that's everything for today i hope that you did enjoy the video let me know down in the comments what you did think about the well all of the items but especially the orange jumpsuit and the little orangey dress because i just need your guys' opinions um but yeah subscribe if you haven't already give the video a thumbs up and i'll see you in my next video bye